when it comes to achieving optimal muscle growth and performance, factors like diet and exercise are by far the most critical. That said, there are a small handful of well-researched supplements shown to have a significant impact on muscle growth and performance. One such supplement that has gained quite a bit of attention is caffeine, a natural stimulant found in common beverages like coffee and tea. Beyond its energy-boosting reputation, caffeine offers intriguing muscle-building benefits. And while caffeine is commonly known for its stimulating effects, its influence on muscle physiology is more complex. In this video, I want to go over the various performance benefits of supplementing with caffeine as well as four ways it'll help you build muscle faster. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Number 1. Caffeine Helps You Achieve More Repetitions one study published in the Journal of Medicine and Physical Fitness compared caffeinated and non-caffeinated trainees on bench press and leg press performance. They found that the caffeinated group performed 11.6% and 19.1% more reps than the non-caffeinated group respectively. Another similar study published in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning Research found that caffeine ingestion led to an increase in reps to failure for upper body movements done at 80% of one rep max. These results indicate that caffeine is effective in promoting small but notable performance improvements through increased training volume. And according to this 2017 study, there is a dose response relationship between training volume and increase in muscle mass, whereby increases in volume produce greater gains in muscle hypertrophy. So while this isn't a direct effect of caffeine on hypertrophy, being able to perform 10 to 20% more reps leads to an increase in total volume load which will indeed promote more muscle growth. Number 2. Caffeine Helps You Push Past Your Limits One study published in the European Journal of Sport Science where participants performed whole body resistance training at 60% of their one rep max in a caffeinated and non-caffeinated state found that caffeinated trainees reported significantly lower RPE and muscle pain perception despite performing greater reps to failure than the placebo group. This is likely due to a reduction in pain signaling, allowing you to push past certain thresholds. In the context of resistance training, this means caffeine allows you to train closer to failure where the set gets even more challenging and painful compared to when you're not in a caffeinated state. And as reported in this meta regression, exploring the dose response relationship of proximity to failure and its training adaptations, muscle growth improves when sets end closer to failure. In other words, reaching the point in your set where there's an involuntary slowing of rep speed is where you get maximal hypertrophy stimulus. Thus, taking caffeine pre-workout helps you push closer to failure with each set, driving driving the increase in growth stimulating reps. Number 3. Caffeine Boosts Performance Despite Sleep Deprivation While we know that consuming caffeine too late in the day disrupts sleep and results in poor training performance, wisely using caffeine can have the opposite effect. One study published in the International Journal of Sport Nutrition and Exercise Metabolism looked at the effects of caffeine ingestion on exercise performance after limited sleep. As expected, the sleep-deprived, non-caffeinated group registered the lowest performance, while the non-sleep-deprived, caffeinated group performed the best. But here's the kicker. The sleep-deprived, caffeinated group performed just as well as the non-sleep-deprived, placebo group. In other words, caffeine ingestion was able to offset the negative performance impact of sleep deprivation. And in case you're wondering, yes, the non-sleep deprived caffeinated group did outperform the non-sleep deprived placebo group, further highlighting the positive impact caffeine ingestion has on exercise performance. Number 4. Caffeine Helps You Train With More Intent This 2008 study 
looked at the effects of caffeine intake on physical and cognitive performance during exhaustive exercise. They found that pre-exercise caffeine consumption resulted in improved performance and improved cognitive ability during and after exercise. And according to the researchers, the improved performance was a result of the improved focus, concentration, and alertness of the participants. Multiple studies have measured the positive effects of caffeine on performance, with some measuring mental readiness before the training session. And for those studies that we found, an increase in mental readiness also correlated with increased performance. This study from De Silva et al. assessed the rhyme or readiness to invest in mental effort of the participants before each workout. They found that the caffeine group, which reported a higher rhyme, also showed improved performance in repeated sets to failure. Another study measured the perceptual measures of arousal and vigor before, during, and after a training session. They found that the participants who ingested caffeine registered higher scores when compared with non-caffeinated participants. They concluded that changes in the perceptual elements of a workout because of caffeine ingestion may have aided in increased workout performance. Not only that, but if caffeine increases training focus, then it can also help establish a better mind-muscle connection. And according to this study, published in the European Journal of Sports Science, focusing on contracting the target muscle resulted in twice as much growth in the biceps when compared to simply lifting the weight up. So, now that we understand the power of caffeine supplementation, let's quickly go over the dosage and timing. According to the position stand of the International Society of Sports Nutrition, caffeine is effective for enhancing various types of performance when consumed in low to moderate doses of around 1 to 3 milligrams per pound of body weight. That said, I recommend starting on the lower end of the range and increasing it gradually over time as needed. While I do suggest consuming caffeine on an as-needed basis to prevent caffeine tolerance, if you plan on using caffeine more frequently, try cycling its consumption to four weeks on and two weeks off in order to continue enjoying its performance effects. Lastly, based on the studies mentioned, I recommend consuming caffeine 30 to 60 minutes before your training session to ensure peak caffeination during your workout. As you can see, Caffeine is one of the best pure ergogenic aids you can use to help you build muscle faster. And when used intelligently, caffeine's muscle building effects make supplementation a no-brainer. Did you find this video helpful? If so, click the like button below as it'll truly help out the channel. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe for more videos and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next one. Peace.